Hallo, hallo, check, check. Klank. Audio, goed hoor. Jo. Beste promovendi, een van de heel grote voordelen van het beroep dat ik mag uitoefenen is dat ik op enkele dagen tijd enkele duizenden gelukkige mensen mag ontmoeten. Daar staat iets tegenover, want die vele mensen verwachten natuurlijk ook wel een toespraak. Maar toegegeven, de good vibes die u telkens opnieuw met z'n allen uitstraalt, maken dat helemaal goed. Het komt dit jaar natuurlijk wel met een extra complexiteit en dat is dat ik uh, zo af en toe op twee, drie proclamaties tegelijkertijd verwacht word. En die techniek van de onthubbeling die beheers ik toch nog niet volledig. Vandaar een toch wat apart medium waar langs ik u vandaag aanspreek. Misschien iets wat minder persoonlijk, maar daarom niet minder gemeend in wat ik zeg. En wat dat gemeende betreft, die boodschap, ik wil u in eerste instantie heel veel geluk toewensen met...
advise every young graduate to become a member of Economic Alumni.
Dancing in the dark, and it soon ends. We're waltzing in the wonder of why we're here. Time hurries by. the music together dancing in the dark Looking for the light of a new love to brighten up the night. 
I have you loving We can face the music Together Dancing in the dark Dancing So nice to me. It's the start of a new day. And there's no place in this world that I'd rather be than right here with midnight and you.
Hearts gone astray Deep in her when they go I went away Just when you need me so You won't regret I'll come back begging you Won't you forget Welcome love we once knew Open up your eyes Then realize Here is that with my everlasting love I need you by my side Heart's gone astray, deep in her and go. I went away just when you needed me so. You won't regret, I'll come back begging you. Won't you forget, welcome love we once knew. What a difference a day made Twenty-four little hours Bought the sun and the flowers Where there used to be rain My yesterday was blue, dear Today I'm a part of you, dear My lonely nights are through, dear Since you said you were mine difference a day made there's a rainbow before me skies above can't be me since then moment 
Heaven when you find romance on your menu. What a difference a day made, and the difference is you. A day makes There's a rainbow before me Skies above can't be me Since that moment of bliss That thrilling kiss It's heaven when you find romance on your menu. What a difference a day made, and the difference is you. Dear students, dear family, dear friends of our students, dear colleagues, welcome at the 2019 June graduation ceremony of KU Leuven, the Faculty of Economics and Business here in Brussels. 
It are really great days for the city of Brussels. You might have seen eh, there is the Grand Depart of the Tour de France that takes place here uh, during the weekend. Yesterday there was already the uh, official team presentation, uh, a ceremonial ride, um, very close here to the campus. And by the way, that's why we have new streets all over Brussels currently. You might have noticed that. Only on the circuit, of course. Um, and tomorrow there will be the first comp really competitive stage of the Tour de France. And today there is no race and you should be very happy about that because otherwise it would have been extremely difficult to reach this location. So we are re really, we coordinated very well with them. It are great days for Brussels, but it are especially great days for you, for you students, for your parents, for your loved ones, for your brothers and sisters, for your grandparents, and I see here currently an auditorium full of very happy, very, very proud faces. You should know that this graduation ceremony, and that's for the first time ever that we do this, it's streamed live on YouTube. So in real time, everywhere in the world, people can see your happy faces. <laughs> so whenever you see a camera, you should wave, you should say hello to your aunt, to your nieces, wherever in the world, they will see you. You have students, family members, loved ones, you have all reasons to be extremely proud. You students, a few years ago, you embarked on a very long journey, or in cycling terms, we call that a tour. A tour on our campus en route to a degree in business administration in MyBEM or in some bridging or a prep program. And as you know, a cycling race like the Tour de France, it consists of many stages. There are easy and flat stages with the wind in your back when it goes very easy and you go with the flow of the peloton. Mm -hmm. But there are, of course, also very difficult mountain stages eh, where you have to do it all by yourself. And it's a bit similar with your study program, of course. There are easy and there are difficult moments. And perhaps the master or the bachelor thesis at the end was the queen stage of your personal Tour de France, Tour de Bruxelles, in fact. During that journey, you have learned a lot about subjects like economics, about management and finance and marketing and so many other subjects. But at the same time, you have learned a lot more about yourself. What are your capabilities? What are your strong points? Perhaps you discovered that you are an extremely good communicator or a good negotiator, perhaps a good planner, an excellent problem solver. But probably you also learned that some of these skills were in need of a small upgrade. And I'm convinced that my dedicated colleagues have made a very significant contribution to that and that they helped you to strengthen your skills. Therefore, on your behalf, I would like to thank all my colleagues for their dedication and efforts to deliver a splendid teaching experience to you. So please give my colleagues a very warm applause for that. At the same time, I realize very much that not all what you have learned in the past few years was offered by us. For many of you, it was the first time living on your own in a different city, probably also in a different country, in a very different language environment, in a mix of languages. For the first time, you had to take care, perhaps, of your own laundry, of your own food and drink requirements. And undoubtedly, you developed and extended your organizational and social networking skills. The translation for the parents of these management buzzwords your offspring, your children have drastically broadened and deepened their knowledge about Belgian fries, Belgian beer, Belgian chocolate. Now I hope that all these experiences, the educational and the non-educational ones, have helped you to discover and to develop towards your so-called future self. This future self is a key concept in the KU Leuven education vision. Now I explain that every year at the first day of the academic year, but that is at least three or four years ago uh, for you, so probably you don't remember. Therefore, a quick recap. The idea, the basic idea behind the future self is in fact very simple. First, we want to help young people to get a better picture 
of the future professional and individual that they want to become. And second, we want to help all those young people to narrow the gap between their current skill set and the desired skill set. Basically, we want to help young people to achieve their professional and personal ideal. And as you all know, it sounds a bit like a cliche, but uh, anyway, it's, it's still true. With this graduation ceremony, your journey will not come to an end. You might have obtained a better picture of your future self. You might even have come closer to your ideal future self. But beyond doubt, there still is some margin for improvement. Lifelong learning will be part of your future career. And you really shouldn't see that as an assignment or a burden, but rather as a unique opportunity. And I can imagine that you are now ready to put into practice the knowledge and the competences that you have acquired during your journey here at KU Leuven. You now want to explore new options. You want to start a new chapter, new experiences. And I really wish you very well on the continuation of your journey. And I hope you will stay connected with us and later tonight, we will tell you how you can stay in touch with us. But before you head off for all these new adventures and experiences, we are going to have a very nice official graduation ceremony together. It's a bit like driving the laps on the Champs-Élysées on the last day of the Tour de France. So today is your moment of glory. Make sure that you enjoy every second of it. And then now uh, I'm very happy that I can give the floor to my colleague, Professor Dr. Bart Rijmakers, who is the Vice Rector of the Humanities and Social Sciences Group of the KU Leuven, who will address you. Mr. Dean, ladies and gentlemen, especially dear students, students not graduated yet. On behalf of our uh, university and on behalf of our rector, I'm very happy to be the first to congratulate you um, at this moment, uh, congratulating you by obtaining the degree in economics from now on you all will belong to the very uh, distinguished company of Leuven economists. And by becoming an economist at the same time, you will also become an alumnus of our university. By receiving and obtaining the degree of bachelor or master in economics, you become right away performative language an alumnus of KU Leuven and of this faculty. Congratulations. And a very warm welcome as well to all the parents, friends and family coming from all over the world to join this ceremony and to share the joy and the pride so peculiar to this occasion. I have the privilege, but it's also a, a pleasure, to participate in about 10 of these kind of ceremonies these days, all over the country. And uh, you can believe me freely, they are interesting, they are captivating. They are all different in every faculty of our university. They are, let's say, light and with some literary uh, aspects in our faculty of arts. They are very serious and even sublime in our faculty of theology. They are very long and um, very um, solemn at the faculty of law. And they are smoothly and efficient at our faculty of economics. But everywhere you can perceive the same atmosphere. The world looks more friendly more open, more enjoyable, and always summertime. 
Um, and this, to this is added nice flowers and some uh, important aspect, music. I once was on a ceremony like this without music. And I can tell you it's quite different because music is an essential aspect of such a ceremony. It gives you the opportunity to reflect upon what has been said before. All this adds to this, what is called in anthropology, a rite de passage, a ritual. A ritual that is characterized by two aspects. One is transformation. You are transformed from a student into a professional. Not yet, perhaps, but it's uh, ongoing. And you will perceive the difference in the next couple of weeks and months. And at the same time, it's also a ritual. And one of the very essential aspects of a ritual is that perhaps the form is more important than the content. What do I mean by this? Well, I can imagine that within five years, within 10 years, you might have forgotten, especially the students, might have forgotten quite a lot from what you learned here at the faculty. I mean, all the statistics, all the theories, they change. Even economic uh, sciences are changing rapidly. So that is not too big a problem if you would forget some of the content of what you've learned here. But it's a ritual because you will remember this day, this specific day. You will remember where you were sitting, who was next to you, and what was the kind of mood you were in. To a certain degree, a bit emotional, to a certain degree proud, and also looking forward to the future. I would like to address especially parents, family, friends who are joining us today. I would like to address them especially because sometimes it is overlooked that they have taken a very important decision a few years ago. They have to show, you had to show, confidence in your son or daughter. You had to show confidence at that moment, but even more, you should persist in this confidence. Because throughout these years, there might have been moments where you, and not only your son or daughter, were having some doubts about their choice, where they were having some doubts about the quality of their professors. And it's only now that you can see and that you can witness yourself that this quality is indeed reached and that this quality is indeed very high. So thank you very much for sending your son and daughter or daughter to our university. And let me um, stay a few moments on something which is really peculiar to this campus. It is Brussels at KU Leuven and it is Leuven in Brussels. Sometimes coming from, I don't know how many countries, it might look a little bit disturbing, a little bit um, strange, but that's the way it is. And it might be helpful to make a distinction between Leuven as a town and KU Leuven as a university. To this audience, I should perhaps use the expression, the brand KU Leuven. Leuven is a town 25 kilometers from here. It's a small town, 100,000 inhabitants. And it's um, only 25 kilometers, but the psychological distance is quite large. Brussels seems to be a um, large town. Leuven thinks, and the inhabitants of Leuven think, that Brussels is far away. But what is more important is KU Leuven is a university that is all over the place. Yesterday, I was in Antwerp at a ceremony, and the day before, we were even at this very cosmopolitan place that is called St. Catalina Waver. <laughs> and the day before, it was in Geel, of all places. And even before, we had a ceremony in Bruges, just to indicate that KU Leuven is not only linked to the town nearby, that KU Leuven is a university that has campuses all over this country. 
and that these campuses, and especially our campus in Brussels, are very dear to us. And that's, of course, also the reason why I am here today, to express our gratitude and our confidence in our campuses in Brussels, in Antwerp, and at all those other places. It's important to mention this because KU Leuven is not only linked to this small town nearby, but it's a concept, it's a brand that is known worldwide. And I think this is something which you will hopefully perceive, and I can be quite sure about this, in the next couple of months, in the next years. That is, KU Leuven is known, known all over the world. Wherever you will uh, be, and wherever you will find your professional career, you will see that people do know KU Leuven. Last week, I had the privilege of being in Lisbon in an international conference, and everyone knew this university. And so I think more than ever, we should also be confident, not only about Brussels as the place where the Grand Depart is taking place, but also as Brussels, as one of our campuses, in Brussels as part of KU Leuven. And let me conclude by giving you one idea or one element to reflect upon in the future. Even when you might have forgotten about the content of the courses you had during the years here in Brussels, even when, you, when Brussels will become a memory afterwards, I think the most important thing is that Leuven and KU Leuven will be not only a place, not only a town, not only a brand, but that it's something that is in, within yourselves, that is in your inner four. And so my hope to all of you is that Leuven remains in your heart, remains in your mind, but also in your heart for the rest of your life. If we have accomplished this, I think we have done a great job. Thank you very much. And if I'm correct, I think I may now announce to you my colleague Dirk Laporte, who is going to play some uh, music on the piano. And it is called Mouvement de Menuette from the Sonatine by Maurice Ravel. Please, the floor is yours.
Professor Laporte for a beautiful interpretation of this piece of music. Dear students, parents, friends, and colleagues, our campus has a long-standing tradition of being business-oriented and entrepreneur-minded. We strive to familiarize our students with this as much as possible during their studies. That's why our programs and staff remain in close contact with the business world. With numerous guest lectures and business seminars as a result. This link is also very important for the projects that our students and colleagues work on in the framework of the entrepreneurial learning track, master thesis and research. We want to give shape to this business orientation through partnerships with leading companies. Colroyd Group, Deloitte and KPMG are our educational partners for this academic year. We work together with them intensively in the field of education, recruitment and visibility. Students get to know the top entrepreneurs and our partners meet students and researchers. Two worlds meet. It creates synergy and is most definitely an added value. Next to our educational partnerships, we also have a lot of other partnerships. This year, we can count on these partners to help us organize ceremonies as this one today. We want to thank all of our partners for the fruitful cooperation and especially for the master's thesis and faculty awards they give to outstanding students. Let's have a look. As you can see, some of you might receive an award from one of our partners. All students who did graduate in January graduate today or will graduate in September of this academic year are eligible to receive one of these awards. So stay tuned. And now the big moment, the conferral of degrees. Before we start, I'd like to make a small practical agreement. Of course, all graduates deserve a warm applause. But can we ask, though, to wait until the results of the whole group have been announced before giving the students a thunderous applause? I would like to conclude with my warmest congratulations to all graduates and give the floor now to my colleague, Professor Dr. Theo Mons, for the proclamation of the results of the Students' Bachelor of Business Administration, Master of Business Administration, and Master of Business Engineering. Dear graduates, Today you reach the end of your journey through the study program. I hope you enjoyed the route and that you will retain good memories and nice friends of it. We, from our point of view, and it has been said before, we saw you grow into competent young people with great potential. So therefore, it is a real pleasure to call your name and to officially proclaim you 
bachelor or master. So let us first start with a bachelor in business administration. Obtain the degree of bachelor of science in business administration with a passing grade. Belinda Achiampon, Claire Ataya, Sashi Bandari, Alexandre Botermans, Ginger Shankai Zambrano, Lena Coupé, Madalena Covelli, Grégoire de Veit, Matisse de Wilde, Justine de Klerk, Pauline de Lorge, Frédéric Hemelaar, Anna Kolsova, Tara Kranchek, Hidera Okeshukwu, Wasim Osmani, Alexandre Rimbaud, Xander Schepens, Rania Tuati, Stefan Wiesenfeld. Obtain the degree of Bachelor of Science in Business Administration with distinction. Alvis Braganini, Eleonore Comper, Ilse de Klerk, Dorian Del Ferriere, Axel Derboven, Selma Huar, Anita Koosmanen, Belen Laia Asensio, Michiel Merchiers, Arthur Toderica Winten, Robin van Eigen, Florence van de Caveille, Midas Veraard en Richard Waldhelm. Obtain the degree of Bachelor of Science in Business Administration with great distinction. Simona Bebe, Shushanik Bejanjan, Febe de Potter, Li Wang Naat, Hosin Xiao, Amelie Labis. So let's give a warm applause for these new graduates. Then we'll continue with the Master of Science in Business Administration. So, obtain the degree of Master of Science in Business Administration with a passing grade. Claire Ataya, Margarita Ausheva, Olivia Bequet, Ruben de Vis, Matisse de Wilde, Duye Delik. Isabel de Smet, Anton Johan Dragici, Nikita Glutschenko, Gompo, Jaron Heimans, Elisabeth Joos, Coralie Junius, Xoni Caio, Dan Loos, Claudia Malvesi Saguer, Elvis Mamani, Jeroen Mewissen, Stanislas Mikriokov, Laurens Missian, Jonathan Naweyi, Alexia Pedro Lopez, Bogdan Penski, Tatiana Rusina, Lasse Sirvieu, David Song, Christ Suli, Rania Tuati, Dukan Tran, Raphael Truyens, Sebastian van der Donkt, Scott Wamskans. Let's give them applause as well.
obtained the degree of Master of Science in Business Administration with distinction, Kasper Albers, Yasmin Awadala, Maximilian Bols, Christophe Bostin, Julien Castellain, Eni Darda, Johan de Schrijver, Claire de Bare, Cis de Jonkheren, Johanna Delmel, Chloe den Hazen, Marie du Bern, Iptissam El Bejati, Fabian Gerold, Marvin Grossman, Eva Hansens, Patrick Hegeman, Alex Hemerijk, Tevje Jacobs, Nikita Kamishnikov, Fanny Lee, Daan Maas, Roxanne Offergeld, Mohamed Hossama, Stanley Post, Joni Sabbe, Lisa Schibor, Hanne Schuitzer, Laurent Spencer, Jonathan van de Loverbos, Romy van Gorp, Eleonor van Marken, Elise Verscharen, Evi Vronen, Giantian Zoe. Obtained the degree Master of Science in Business Administration with great distinction. Flore Blues, Sarah Sheriffi, Alexander Maas, Sophie Michiels, Lando Suits, Hans van der Wegen, Hanna Wouters and Kevin Xebexia. Let's again give them all a very warm applause. And then we continue with the Master in Business Administration double degree program Montpellier. These students actually graduated last academic year, but due to administrative reasons, they were not uh, proclaimed yet, so we do it uh, now. So obtained the degree of Master of Science in Business Administration, double degree program Montpellier, with a passing grade, Joris Kerkhoffs, with distinction, Nick de Luik, and Mariam Hemadi, with great distinction, Berkeley Morganto, Tine van den Hogen, and Chloe van der Hoof. Let's give them <laughs> all time. Next is the Master in Business Engineering. So obtained the degree of Master of Science in Business Engineering with distinction, Edward van Kutsum, with great distinction, Christopher Bockel Ganant Rickerman, and Amar Kadu. Let's also give them. Now, we also want to mention today the students who successfully completed the full 60, cred 60, 60 credits Brussels component of the extended Master in Business Administration and who will leave us to continue their study abroad. So these students are Julien de Kuber, Alexis Dirks, Elisabeth Glorieux, Lise Smets, Sebastian Stalen, 
Sebastiaan van der Velde en Christophe Wouters. Our sincere congratulations to all graduates and success in the continuation with your career. And I'll now pass the floor to Professor Dr. Dirk van Lint for the conferral of degrees of the students, Master of International Business Economics and Management. Thank you very much, Theo, ladies and gentlemen, especially uh, my BEM students. I'm convinced that you would like to have more friends and more family members here in this room today. But I know that many of you, these people are living thousands and miles from here. Maybe there it's evening, night or morning. But I'm sure that they are thinking about you and that there are hundreds that you will graduate today in Brussels. And after this ceremony, you will probably use Skype, WhatsApp, Instagram, or maybe another online tool to contact them and to celebrate your graduation with them. Today, in the words of Angela Merkel, we may say, Dieu, Dieu has es geschafft. Here are Les Miles Room of the MIBEM program. The following students obtained the degree of Master in International Business Economics and Management with a passing grade. Siad Ahmed Abbas, Heriberto Alva Arzate, Anastasia Angelou, Leticia Bemberg, Mara Benetetti, Jack. Berrien, Nicolas Brown, Juliana Schu, Thomas Kleis, Alice de Liedekerke, Justine Flacotier, Gergely Gatti, Aton Geers, Ese Goksebei, Yixing Huang, Effil Kafkasli, Xiu Lu, Rebecca Nakalema, Anna Nopano, Cartazina Veronica Novak, Xavier Obay Ishima Okitambi, Alberto Aolite Perez, Alexia Robles Dobelaar, Charlotte Sauk, Anastasia Solioglu, Oscar Stude, Simon van Oudenhoven, Catherine Wittaker, Zia Shu, Marina Zastafna. Obtain the degree of Master in International Business Economics and Management with distinction. Monica Adame, Daira Boll, Alisa Brennan, Meara Amidiani, Alexander Jasinski, Dana Peterson, Sebastian Plaszczek, Emilio Planes de Rego, Anna Seridicio, Tim Solberger, Ilse Taleman, Kettle White, Ion Zong, and obtain the degree of Master in International Business Economics and Management with great distinction, Alexi Erola, Aditi Kala, Zoe Kruchten, Chen Lu, Christopher Mac Mahon, Oli Christian Solheimnes, and Kean Tain. A warm applause for all the students. <laughs> and I'd like to give now the floor to my colleague, Professor Tom van Puyenboek, who represent the Alumni Association, but first join me in watching the following video.
Beste promovendi, een van de heel grote voordelen van het beroep dat ik mag uitoefenen is dat ik op enkele dagen tijd enkele duizenden gelukkige mensen mag ontmoeten. Daar staat iets tegenover, want die vele mensen verwachten natuurlijk ook wel een toespraak. Maar toegegeven, de good vibes die u telkens opnieuw met z'n allen uitstraalt, maken dat helemaal goed. Het komt dit jaar natuurlijk wel met een extra complexiteit en dat is dat ik uh, zo af en toe op twee, drie proclamaties tegelijkertijd verwacht word. En die techniek van de onttubbeling die beheers ik toch nog niet volledig. Vandaar een toch wat apart medium waar langs ik u vandaag aanspreek. Misschien iets wat minder persoonlijk, maar daarom niet minder gemeend in wat ik zeg. En wat dat gemeende betreft, die boodschap, ik wil u in eerste instantie heel veel geluk toewensen met... Uw diploma, uh, u vooral ook proficiat toewensen met dat diploma. En naast die proficiat, het tweede belangrijke woord is een welgemeende dank u. Dank u voor uw keuze voor Leuven, uw keuze voor de KU Leuven. Misschien de KU Leuven op een andere plaats. Aalst, Antwerpen, Brugge, Brussel, Gent, Geel, Diepenbeek, sint katelijne waver Kortrijk. Want KU Leuven vandaag de dag, Leuven is de naam van een stad, maar KU Leuven is eigenlijk een begrip, is een instituut. Op vele plaatsen aanwezig, op vele plaatsen verankerd. Een instituut dat een bijzondere plaats heeft in mijn hart en ik hoop dat dat in de toekomst bij u niet anders is. Ik wil u ook heel erg danken voor wat u gedurende meerdere jaren echt wel opgenomen heeft. Samen met ons deze universiteit maken tot wat ze is. Deze universiteit is niet alleen in mij en in onze professoren en onze personeelsleden. Ze is in elk van ons, ook in u. U denkt misschien dat u straks die universiteit verlaat, maar... Dat is technisch onmogelijk. Wij zijn een beetje zoals die slogan van Radio 2. Altijd dicht bij jou. U zal dat merken in de toekomst. Beste promovendi, vergeet vooral niet, u verwerft vandaag ook een diploma dat u bijzondere krachten geeft. De kracht van het woord, de kracht van de argumentatie, de kracht van de analyse, van de synthese, de kritische zin. De kracht ook voor de toekomst. Op die toekomst hebben we u gedurende meerdere jaren proberen voor te bereiden. Grijp die krachten. In die toekomst. We hebben nu ook een ethisch referentiekader proberen meegeven. En dat is toch wel erg, erg belangrijk in tijden van fake news en alternatieve waarheid. Want die waarheid, dat weet u ook, dat is het hoogste goed van deze universiteit. Die waarheid verdraagt geen alternatief. Leugens, fake news, zijn geen alternatief voor de waarheid. Hou u er ver van. Dat ethisch referentiekader zal u daarbij helpen. Het is geen uitvinding van KU Leuven. Maar u weet ook, wij durven heel expliciet zijn over de waarden die we heel graag uitdragen. Ik sluit heel graag af met een warm dankwoord aan iedereen die u op het pad hier naartoe, naar deze proclamatie, zo uitstekend geholpen heeft. Ik mag natuurlijk onze professoren niet vergeten. De vele medewerkers van de faculteiten van de opleidingen die alweer een jaar het beste van zichzelf gegeven hebben. Maar ik wil hier vooral toch afsluitend even stilstaan bij vrienden en familie. Vader, moeder, grootvader, grootmoeder, broers, zussen, geliefden, verliefden, goede vrienden, beste vrienden. Zij hebben u eigenlijk tot aan die universiteit gebracht. Wij kleuren vervolgens bij, wij kleuren in, maar we zijn eigenlijk toch wel laatkomers in dat traject. Vooral aan vader en moeder aanwezig op deze proclamatie. Ik hoop dat deze dag ook voor u vooral een heel heugelijke dag is... Een heel bijzondere dag en dat u volop meedeelt in de hulde die zoon of dochter vandaag te beurt valt. Ik wens u allen een bijzonder mooi leven, een bijzonder, mooi, een bijzonder mooie loopbaan ook. Veel liefde, veel warmte, veel rijkdom in de enige echte betekenis van dat woord die telt. En vooral, vergeet ik aan uw leuven niet, wij vergeten u niet. Vice-Rector, today addressed to you in the beginning of the ceremony as uh, dear students. So I'm the very first one, I think, that is able to address you as dear KU Leuven alumni. I will join uh, our rector and express both my congratulations for what you have achieved and to uh, my sincerest thanks to you as well as to your beloved ones for having put faith in us over the years that have just finished. Indeed, for some of you, this is the end. Some of you I could address as dear ex-students, because here and now, 
in this place at this moment, for some of you, your KU Leuven time is over. Or so it only seems, because I'm here to tell you that you can easily stay in touch with us, with your classmates, and in fact can get to know literally thousands of others who once graduated as, at this faculty, just are you, as you are doing today. I invite you to have a look at what the Alumni Association has in store for you. every young graduate to become a member of Economic Alumni because we organize a lot of fun and practical events and it's a really nice way to keep in touch with everyone you studied with. We bring people from different generations together in a professional and friendly environment. People can meet and learn from each other and have a good time. We have activities organized in each of the Belgian provinces, and even abroad. So recently we opened a chapter in, uh, in London. It's a great way to stay connected. I joined the Alumni Association because of the many networking opportunities and also the quality of the speakers and the lectures. I was very happy to still be able to contribute to career efforts at this faculty and to stay in touch with the student life. We are very proud of our alumni. They are the best ambassadors of our faculty. Uh, and they are the proof of the high quality standards that we deliver in our education. Okay, don't worry. I know, I do know that there is a reception waiting and I therefore won't add too much to what you have just seen. Yet, in a way, uh, the length of what I have to say is inversely proportional to its importance. Let me explain that. Studying, I know you, ex you have experienced it, studying takes a few years, graduating takes a few hours, but then it's over and done. These things both end, but as from now on, you will be a KU Leuven alumna or alumnus every day of your remaining life and even beyond. <laughs> I can only confirm and document further what the rector said in his speech. As far as KU Leuven is concerned, as far as this faculty is concerned, we are very ready and very willing to continue acting as your host the following years. And with alumni chapters in Brazil, Ethiopia, Germany, India, Indonesia, Japan, the Netherlands, even the Netherlands, Shanghai, <laughs> Thailand, the UK, the US and Vietnam, that may even be closer to your home country than you have expected. Or, if you plan to stay closer to here, there are the faculty's regional chapters, such as in Brussels. With more than two events per month on average, the Economica Alumni Association allows you to learn firsthand from renowned business leaders, politicians, diplomats, scientists, and leading cultural figures about their views on current, current events. Just to take two examples, last week we were informed about the possibly misleading information that can be sent about television audiences and live spectators for major sports events such as the Tour de France takeoff, that was only last week. And some years ago we learned the last details about Brexit from the, Bre from the British ambassador, literally at the same moment that Theresa May was informing her fellow government leaders about their plans. We not only have this type of, event, of events, we also take you behind the scenes and straight into the boardrooms of major banks, enterprises, harbors, airports, museums, and we use the CEO as your guides. And we'll always, I promise you, we'll always provide you with a beer afterwards. In fact, as you have seen, we sometimes meet just to do only that. And we also provide you with ample time for you to chat with both these leading figures as well as with dozens of others like you who together constitute a valuable and sociable network of all ages and specialisms. So, I cordially invite you to briefly visit the economic, uh, Economica alumni desk during the reception. They will welcome you with open arms. You will have the chance to have your photo taken 
don't hesitate to become an Economica alumni member. It is definitely a great asset to your further career. And talking about careers and the power of networks, I remind you that our faculty also offers personal guidance to its graduates. Don't forget to visit our online career corner platform and gain access to num numerous interesting job offers. You will be the first to know which employers are looking for your profile. And now it is about time and certainly my pleasure to invite you to the reception and I ha still have to make some practical announcements here before you can actually go to, re to the reception. It will start, of course, that's logic, right after this ceremony. You can reach the reception room on the first floor by using all the doors on your right, that's my left, huh? so that's your right. Just follow the person in front of you and eventually you get there. <laughs> we would love to have a, a group picture taken there straight after the ceremony on the terrace uh, next to the break so that we have a record, that you have a record, as if it were of the bonds of friendship of the graduates of 2019. And that picture will be sent to you by email afterwards. And for those who eventually are interested, you can also pick up your results if you want. And a provision certificate in the provisional certificate in the reception room, that's 1119. Okay, and as this ceremony almost comes to its end, let me say that I'm not the only one who wanted to congratulate you with your degree. Let's have a look. Proficiat with your diploma. Proficiat. Congratulations with your degree. Proficiat. Van harte proficiat met het behalen van jullie diploma. Jullie beginnen jullie carrière op het meest ongelooflijke moment. Dus juist midden in de vierde industriële revolutie. Het beste moment waar alles moet heruitgevonden worden, alles op een nieuwe manier moet bekeken worden. Begin vooral niet je carrière op een traditionele manier, in een traditioneel bedrijf. Kijk wat je nieuw kunt gaan doen. Volg je passies. Doe leuke dingen. Voornamelijk, have fun. Succes. Congratulations. Proficiat met je diploma. Beste promovendi, eerst en vooral van harte gefeliciteerd met het slagen van de examens en het behalen van dat diploma. En nu komt de carrière eraan. Ik ben zelf dierenarts van opleiding en vandaag CEO van de VRT. Een heel bizarre uh, loopbaan die ik heb doorlopen, maar die me enorm veel heeft bijgebracht. Dus mijn advies aan jullie is, wees niet te beperkt in waar jullie mee aan de slag willen, maar uh, neem die gedurfde keuzes ter hand. En ik wens jullie heel veel succes. En wie weet is een van jullie binnenkort wel de nieuwe CEO van de VRT of de nieuwe rector van de KU Leuven. Congratulations! Als jullie één ding voor ogen houden, en dat is een quote van Confucius die zegt: Choose a job you like and you will not work a day in your life. Felicitations! Congratulations! 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 Oké. Okay, uh... While, while you were looking at that video, I was checking my watch. I was actually checking whether the vice rector was right in saying that uh, our graduation ceremonies are smooth and efficient. The smooth part holds, it's a hold, huh? it's, 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 it went rather smooth. But you may wonder about efficiency. There's a piano and we have only used it once. Did the economists really rent a piano for just one play? <laughs> no. So. Our dear colleague, and indeed it is a colleague, actually it's a professor of chemistry and a program director of one of our Dutch speaking programs as his hobby, and normally he plays the piano. He will play one more piece of music. Again, it's a French piece of music. I wonder whether that has to do with the Grand Départ. <laughs> Dirk Laporte will play for you Je, me, Je Te Veux, excusez-moi, Je Te Veux by Eric Satie. Dirk, floor is yours. Have a great summer, have a good life. <laughs>
just what I'm thinking of Come nightmare You can always stay awake Comes depression You may get another break Comes love Nothing can be done Nothing can be done Nothing can be done Left you by the house of fun. I don't know why I didn't come. I don't know why I didn't come. When I saw the break of day, I wish that I.
watching teardrops in my hand. My heart is drenched in white. But you'll be on my mind forever. Out across the endless sea, I would die. Something has to make you run. I don't know why I didn't come. My feel is empty as a drum. I don't know why I didn't come. I don't know why.
What is there to say? And what is there to do? The dream I've been seeking has practically speaking come true. What is there to say? And how will I pull through? I knew in a moment contentment and home meant just you. You are so lovable. So livable, your beauty is just unforgivable. You're made to marvel at, and words to that effect. So, what is there to say? And what is there to do? My heart's in a deadlock. I'd even face wedlock with you. What is there to do? My heart's in a deadlock. I'd even face wedlock with you.
another bright, another June, another sunny honeymoon, another season, another reason for making whoopee. A lot of shoes, a lot of rice. The groom is nervous, he answers twice. It's really killing that he's so willing to make a whoopee. Picture a little loveness down where the roses cling. Picture that same sweet loveness. I think what a year can bring. Uh, he's washing dishes and baby clothes. He's so ambitious, he even sews. But don't forget, folks, that's what you get, folks, for making whoopee. Another year, or maybe less. What's this I hear? Well, can't you guess? She feels neglected. Ah, oh, and the boy is suspected of making whoopee. She sits alone most every night. The man won't phone her, he won't even write. He says he's busy, but is he? I think he's making whoopee. Now he doesn't make much money. It's so much cheaper than making whoopee. Mm, you better keep her. Can't you see it's so much cheaper? The question that I pose is really easy. It came to me the moment you walked by. seemed to me you looked at me so sweetly the moment that I stared into your eyes are you the one to steal my heart completely are you the one that I am to adore are we the pair that slips away discreetly? Are you the one that I have waited for? We can toast the moon sitting by a fire And then walk hand in hand for others to admire are you the one to paint the town so brightly? Are you the one I simply can't ignore? Are we the pair that dance together nightly? Are you the one that I have waited for? To paint the town so brightly 
Are you the one I simply can't ignore? Are we the pair that dance together nightly? Are you the one? Are you the one? Are you the one? So sad, you feel so low. Feel so low. Life seems so bad. I know. I know. I know. That's how it goes. That's how it goes. You may think it's funny, but it always shows. Try to hide it, honey. Oh no. It shows. That's how it goes. Some people say. the sea somewhere waiting for me my lover stands on golden sands and watches the ships that go sailing somewhere beyond the sea she's there watching for me and if I could fly like birds on high, then straight to her arms I go sailing. It's far beyond the stars. It's near beyond the moon. I know. Sure, we'll kiss a 
just as before. Happy will be beyond the sea. as before and happy will be beyond the sea and never again I will see Secret love that lived within the heart of me. All too soon, my secret love came impatient to be free. So I took a friendly star. Often do just how wonderful you are. Why I'm so in love with you. Now I shout it from the hardest tears.
Shake up the sun, laugh like a loon. Everything is fun. It's crazy, but I'm in love. I act like a fool. What do I care? I'll be a fool as long as you're there. It's crazy, but I'm in love. I spread my wings and then I fly all around the city. The world's my sweet potato pie, and I'm sitting mighty pretty. I sweep out the stars, chase that old moon, fall into bed. I'm in a tune. It's crazy, but I. This big time ride is all I know. A picture perfect life on show. Stellar nights that never end, and people claim to be your friend. But you are the one I need. No place I'd rather be. Here only I can breathe. Love is a simple thing for me. Please don't take that away. Choose the plainly spoken prose. You are the one I need. No place I'd rather. Away from me, excuse me if it's all the same. What matters now is our ordinary day.
ešte vyberú soli Na to kruel ču na pešan. Trište sa vehky nemien počiť, vieti ľuza, kým nukavaj sa, nukavaj ťa, usoňa do tenťa kochta. Para pra te ver passar Só pra me maltratar Triste é viver na solidão Triste é viver na solidão Na dor cruel de uma paixão Triste é saber que ninguém pode viver de ilusão que nunca vai ser, nunca vai dar O sonhador tem que acordar Tua beleza é um avião Demais pra um pobre coração Que para pra te ver passar Só pra me maltratar Triste é viver na solidão Triste é viver na solidão Na dor cruel de uma paixão Triste é saber que ninguém pode viver de ilusão Que nunca vai ser, nunca vai dar O sonhador tem que acordar Para pra te ver passar Só pra me maltratar Triste é viver na
Dancing in the dark And it soon ends We're waltzing in the wonder Of why we're here Time hurries by We're here And we're gone Looking for the Of a new love to brighten up the night. I have you, love, and we can face the music together, dancing in the dark.
of a new love to brighten up the night. I have you, love, and we can face the music together, dancing. in this world that I'd rather be than right here with midnight and you. Right on, baby. Right on.
heart's gone astray deep in her when they go i went away just when you needed me so you won't regret i'll come back begging you won't you forget welcome love we was new open up your eyes then realize here is never my everlasting love i need you by my side girl to be my pride Heart's gone astray, deep in her when they go. I went away just when you needed me so. You won't break free. I'll come back begging you. Won't you forget? Welcome love we once knew. What a difference a day made 24 little hours Bought the sun and the flowers Where there used to be rain My yesterday was blue dear Today I'm a part of you dear My lonely nights are through dear Since you said you were my difference a day made there's a rainbow before me skies above can't be stormy since then moment of bliss that thrilling kiss 
heaven when you find romance on In your eyes, I look, your smile can disguise. 